So first things first, find a medium med pack, or at least buy one. Oh, there's no store right here. Hydroponics log, Dr. Elizabeth Cross reporting. I'm pleased to say that we're working close to maximum capacity at the present time. All flora is healthy and thriving and food yield has created a surplus. I was going to pass the surplus on to the colony, but the captain has given a no-fly order. I want to note my opposition to that order. Everyone knows they're in trouble down there, and I don't see what denying them our surplus will achieve. Well, the captain must have been crazy like the rest of them. Or he knew what was going on and just wanted people to die. Good. God. Did everyone just rush to the bathrooms when the outbreak happened? Damn it. Did not expect that. Here we go, medium med pack. Exactly what I needed. Now I wonder if I should actually upgrade my health. So far nothing's been able to one hit kill me. And I won't really need an upgrade if I don't get hit. I'm wondering if just upgrading my weapons would be a better strategy. Oh, screw you. Can't believe I jumped from a freaking sprinkler, man. Is that Hammond? It is. Isaac. Good to see you in one piece. Don't take your helmet off. The head's rotten. I gotta look at it. <coughs> it's huge. You won't believe it. Shut itself in food storage. Crew that was on this deck. I think they're what's poisoning the air. They've been transformed. I saw one of them. Bloated. Swollen. They're like poison factories. We need to take him out where we can still breathe. Hammond! I thought you were dead. You need to get to cleaner air. You're not going to be able to help Isaac in your condition. Isaac, I'm scanning the area now. He's right, there's something really big in food storage. But I can't get a good scan. Monitor readings are off the scale. Be careful. Uh, we actually haven't taken a look at our objectives in a while. Right now it's destroy the poison pods. Oh, and you can choose your many different paths to different poison pods.
Where are those behind him? Are those pumpkins? Lockdown. You have to destroy the pods to bring the air quality up. Then you can go through and use the poison on the Leviathan. Alright, I guess I have to do these side missions then. I suppose they're not really side missions, but it's too bad we can't just blow open the door, you know? by that one air can, just in case, since it says the poison's bad. Why does it want me to go into that area first? What is over here? I suppose I should be glad that Ham's alive, but I still don't trust him. I think he's hiding something about the marker. Okay, I don't want to go there. <laughs> I'll go where it tells me to go. That area looked kind of creepy. Professor Jaegerwald? Oh, and Dr. Cross. Another one of these pricks. I thought that would have killed it. It almost sounds like the creature's sighing when you kill it. I wonder, like, maybe part of the humanity in it is still alive? And it's in so much pain that, like, when you finally kill it, it's, it's like breathing a sigh of relief. box. Alright, we got one node. Oh god! I was not prepared for that one. Oh, man. Okay, how much space do I have left? Alright, I'm gonna have to buy another node soon or something. I have to remember there's that power node door there. Because sometimes you find interesting logs and things like that within those unlockable doors. Uh, 
vegetative anomalies detected in the East Grove Chamber. Are these the vegetative anomalies? What is this room? Hazardous anomaly detected. Quarantine activated. What? There's like this thing gasping for breath. I have to go through here. Oh man, what are you? Oh man, that was close. Firing at me. Oh, hey, got a trophy for that. That's an ammo saver. These guys are big, but they're not all that mobile. Sweet, I got a power node. All right, so let's go back to that door. No logs, unfortunately. I was hoping we'd get a log or something like that. Right here, let's just... There we go. What is making that noise? Oh yeah, we gotta kill those things. Seven more. Jeez. At least you got one of them, right? Okay, I could get one there. Let's see what's in these doors. Oh, it's you guys for sure tainting the air. Stomps aren't very accurate. There's a bunch of times I think I'm gonna stomp something into the ground and I miss. All 
All right, now maybe there's something here. Gosh, those things are annoying. I didn't even notice these. <laughs> now I can pick that up. These growths are just vomiting stuff. Maybe it's talking about the Leviathan. You gotta love when you find a power node. You're not going to make me miss out on the semiconductor. Um, I guess I'll drop the air can there for now. Hopefully I won't exactly need it. Oh god! That was close. It almost dragged me into that hole. Here, let's get this explosive canister. Is it not going to let me grab it? Here we go. Man, that was freaky. I forgot that there was another tentacle grabbing part. I think those probably belong to the Leviathan. And it just like worked its way into the ship, you know? Wait, did my... The canister disappeared again. Why does it do that? There's like sections of the stage where you're not allowed to bring them. Acting Chief Engineer, I came down here to find Dr. Elizabeth Cross, but she's not here. In fact, I can't find anyone, just more of this organic shit everywhere. I'm going to check the mining deck. It's about the only place I haven't looked yet. It's interesting to hear Jacob Temple's journey through the ship. Entering zero gravity.
Look at this dude's head. I killed it. Stupid babies. There, no more electricity. Now I don't have to worry about getting burnt to a crisp. Now where am I going? How do I get down there now? Can I just walk over it or what? Alright, I guess I just go through here. Just hope no aliens attack me while in the sticky stuff. My mobility is severely restricted. <laughs> <laughs> 